guys have been driving by this uh, lobster roll truck for years. Is that not one of the coolest lobster roll trucks you've ever seen? Check it out. It's an early international badass. That's vintage awesomeness right there. I mean, you don't see something like this every day. That's why I'm stopping. I mean, it's such a cool vehicle. In the back is where you'd uh, order your lobster rolls. That's actually quite reasonable for a lobster roll in Maine. Hey guys, check out this cool building that it's parked at. That's kind of cool, you know. That place was probably hopping back in the day. But that's where the lobster roll trucks parked in that driveway. See, lobster roll truck. And the Kenny Bunk machine shop. Very cool. There's mistletoe representing. Cool church, very New England-esque. And when you quadruple on two signs, you can get a lobster roll. Guys, if you've never been to the main diner, definitely check it out, man. This place has awesome food. Okay, guys, for $19, here's what you get from the main diner. You get a packed hot lobster roll, melted butter, pickle, coleslaw. Talk to you guys in a bit. So the food was great as always, but you know what I just noticed guys? That sign used to be a beautiful red and blue neon and they replaced it with just a cheesy plastic new sign. So that's definitely a thumbs down for signage, but the food was great. Some got, sometimes you just gotta stop, guys, you know? It's an institution. This is one of the cleaner ones that I've been to in the country. That's what I'm talking about. A small Heath bar. Chocolate Blizzard. Now we're rolling through Ogunquit, Maine. Cool little place, not really my thing, but you know, lots of shops and shit that most people like. But anyway, that's that. 